Sequences that consist of more than one chromosome, contig, or fragment are called multi-segment files. Suppose we want to string together the consensus sequences from all of the contigs in an assembly, or chromosomes in a genome, or exons in a gene. If we enter these sequences using File, Enter Sequences, or the corresponding button, we will end up aligning the parts to one another. By instead entering these sequences into Megaline Pro using the procedure described in this video, the entire set of sequences in the multi-segment file or set of files will be treated as an end-to-end -end concatenation. If you'd like to perform the alignment on your own computer, the data files can be downloaded from our website by clicking on Support and then Tutorials, then clicking the link for either the Windows or Macintosh tutorial data. Once you've unzipped the files, you'll find the data for this tutorial in the Demo Megaline Pro folder. We'll begin with an empty new project. To add our sequences, we can either choose File, Add Sequences End-to-End, -end, or click on the Add Sequences End-to-End -end in Project tool. Next, we'll click the Add button and navigate to our data. The data used in this video are nucleotide files representing the RP1 exons for seven mammalian species. Each exon consists of three to four segments. We'll use shift and click to select the first four segments, which are chimpanzee, and then click open. In the group name text box, we'll replace the default name with chimp, and then click OK. Because the add another button was checked, the dialog opens again automatically so we can add the next group of files. By using this procedure several more times, I've created separate groups for the cow, dog, human, mouse, rat, and rhesus sequences. In each case, I replace the generic group name with the informal species name. In the overview, observe that each species is represented by multiple gray blocks of different lengths. Blue dividers show where one segment ends and another begins. Now we can align the multi-segment sequences. For this example, I'll use the muscle algorithm. To do this, we just click on the Align button and choose Align using Muscle. Once the alignment is finished, we can easily see the phylogenetic tree by clicking on the Tree tab at the bottom of the Megaline Pro window. As you can see, the phylogenetic tree graphically illustrates very plausible evolutionary relationships for the seven species.